Hey guys, this is Cameron Boyce at Young Hollywood. I'm sitting here with Cameron Boyce. Cameron Boyce. Hello. Cameron Boyce here at the Kids' Choice Awards. The one and only adorable Cameron Boyce. Oh, stop it. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. And the pose is like this. First impression of Young Hollywood. The pillows are incredible here. Can I just say, I, I posted about this before, but James Franco is the creepiest man. <laughs> Look at his face in this. It's I love James Franco, but this is this is wild. Are we getting this? <laughs> Are we getting this? Uh, back and forth, but he looks crazy. All right, that's <laughs> that's my first impression. Is that the pillows are insane? joined by Cameron Boyce here at the Kids' Choice Awards 2017. What's up? Nothing much, just kind of madness right now. Well, what's your favorite thing about the Kids' Choice Awards? I think the celebration of what we do, making it fun, bringing them joy, you know? I think this sort of group of people takes pride in that, you know? You can't get something for nothing, you know? That sounds like Corella to me. Is it not? Uh, no! Okay, then it's... Oh, it's the Evil Queen. Uh, oh, no! Oh, no! This is bad now. All it right, begins well with then. a letter that's towards the end of the alphabet. Oh, you... See, that's a trick question, because I thought we were Sorry? going Descendants 1. Are you talking about Ursula? Yeah! See, I was thinking <laughs> Descendants 1. All right. You got it. No, not you really, got but it. all right. <laughs> well, we're going to count it. We're uh, going to count it. Two for three is what, 70 some percent? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, I'm sorry. I even think we should give it to you. That was pretty good. <laughs> you were not dressed for slime, though, I got to say. I know. It's the white. Who dressed you? What happened? Well, Katie Wofford is amazing. She's awesome. But, you know, I don't think we took into account that the green might not mix well with the, I don't know. I've never been slimed, so I can't like. What's applesauce? I don't, I don't, maybe people like to be slimed because it tastes good. Or if you don't like applesauce, I don't know. I also heard vanilla pudding. You don't like vanilla pudding? Well, what? Just, well no, 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 just the, the difference between applesauce and vanilla pudding, like I don't, that's, that's a little strange. Maybe um, a little bit of both, I mean. How you get both in one, I don't know, that's, that's, that's weird. Hashtag your life right now, what would that hashtag be? Hashtag right now, currently, hashtag uh, uh, awesome. That was so bad. This is the yeah. first project I've been hearing yeah, about. Yeah, this is, I'm wearing my hoodie right now. Um, oh, that I didn't happen this. on purpose. He I just designed this. Wear it. <laughs> Check it out. No, um, it's really cool. So cool. I have had a relationship with the Thirst Project for a while now. One of my favorite things about the uh, design is the wording that I chose. We are the generation that won the water crisis. And to me, every major issue that we have right now, politically, whatever, um, you know, the LGBTQ plus community, gun control, Black Lives Matter, equal pay for women, all of these things that need to be addressed are all being uh, forefronted by young people. It feels good to know you can actually That's, make that difference. Right, and, you actually and could we are it making it. that difference in every yeah. one of those issues plus more, right? But you know, it's, it's a really uh, cool thing to know that you're a part of a generation that is you know, loud yeah. and proud. So. And we were talking about it earlier. So you designed these. Mm -hmm. So these are the t-shirts that he's selling to obviously right, help with yeah. this charity. So this we is cool. We got hoodies, we got t-shirts, <laughs> we got tank tops. No, we, It's fun to design <laughs> clothes though too. Aside from right. the fact that it's for a good cause. Right. You're such a good draw. I mean, this is Thank amazing. You. Yeah, no, I, I, how hands I sketched hard this. To draw and, I sketched yeah. this. Yeah, it's, it was difficult. Hardest part about it was my signature. No, it was cool. <laughs> I had a, I had a good time. You know, it's, it's really cool to sort of find ways to express yourself and this is sort of like an outlet to do something cool for yeah. you know charity but then also to sort of explore your artistic side it's really cool yeah this right here is uh, where i practice cuz i just got my license you know get off the road but uh, no <laughs> put this your helmets on pedestrians for real. yeah we got a stick here it's a clutch so i'm um, you know i'm doing the I'm doing the thing, you know? Did you practice Shifting, for your driving test here? Yeah. Here? Really? On the clutch, off the gas, shift. So yes. Some sort of dance you can teach a newbie like me. I mean, I know that we're kind of chained here to the couch <laughs> without mics. Yeah, we're chained. Is there something like this? Yeah, we can, yeah, you can do a little, a little wave, you know what I'm saying? Okay, well this is dance. why 
you're in this industry. I think John Cena has to be the one to get slimed. He needs to. He needs to. He needs to take it right. Point, at some point, I need to protect Gwen Stefani. So you're you're saving Gwen. I'm saving Gwen. John gets the slime. John gets the Who are you getting slimed with? I'm getting slimed with. Oh, train. I keep saying that. <laughs> That'd be funny. And if you could face swap with anyone tonight, who would it be? Probably Gwen Stefani. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, yeah, that'd be amazing. Red lipstick and blonde hair. It'd be cool. I'd like to see her with like your freckles. Yeah, that'd be weird. Yeah. Yeah. That, that'd be an interesting face swap, no doubt. This right here is, is a lot of you. This is a lot of me. <laughs> I would never have this much of my face where I'm hanging out. But Don't lie. This is Connor's, just like you rubbing this is your just, room. This it's was your my room. Idea. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is this is this is all Connor. You know, he's all okay. confidence. He loves yeah. himself apparently. First job you ever had? It was a print ad. So I was modeling essentially. I was a pretty cute kid. I don't know what happened to me, but I was doing print for Disney, actually, that's hilarious. And um, I was a dancer, so I did this pose. They had me on a trampoline, and I was like jumping on the trampoline, and then they had me do a pose where I like touched my toes, and the pose is like this. <laughs> <laughs> and it's the craziest photo, and people still post that. I still get tagged in that photo <laughs> on Instagram, and it's not embarrassing at all. I'm actually very proud of it.